you guys. I feel pretty. I'm loving my makeup today. I just filmed this look right now on my reel and TikTok if you guys wanna go check it out. It's already up. But um, welcome to today's video. So today's video is a day in the life with me as a content creator. I'm really excited to bring you guys along, show you what goes on behind the scenes and all the stuff we do on days like this. Today's a pretty jam-packed day as well. We are clearly filming a YouTube video. I just shot this makeup reel. I'm now gonna go in and shoot some beauty shots and then we have four outfit changes we're gonna be going into. So I'm excited to show you guys the behind the scenes, what we do, I'm also gonna be showing you guys how I fill out my content planner as well because it's something that has truly changed my life Something that I find so helpful and really maps out my entire month for me But um, if you guys are into these videos go ahead and continue watching before we get started I got to give a big thank you to JHG for working with me in today's video to talk to you guys all about their new unplugged tool First and foremost, it is JHG's first cordless tool meaning you can use it on the go Meaning I can use it when I'm switching outfits and touch up my hair and get different looks and it looks like I'm shooting on completely different days I've been using this tool non-stop since it launched especially when I'm on the go if I'm switching hairstyles if I need to touch up it's the perfect tool to use so I'm gonna bring it along with me today as we go and take photos of these outfits and show you guys how to change your hair in between and how to touch up and just all the cool things you need to know about it so if you guys are excited go ahead and continue watching before we get started subscribe if you are not and without further ado let's go ahead and get into today's video first thing I do is check my phone I have a habit of doing that making sure everything's okay and then after that I went directly to my computer and then I check my emails this is very important to me to make sure I'm caught up with any contracts emails of brands emails of my management and then from there I transfer any new information into my work planner after that I went downstairs and got in my morning workout I need to get in my workout no matter how busy my day is like I have to squeeze it in the morning or I'm not gonna get it done so I worked out today and it was hard so hard I ran back upstairs still in my gym clothes to get on a zoom call at 10 a.m. and this zoom call was a must to go over something really exciting that I'm doing with the brand this weekend so we just kind of went over final details and everything going on then after that I jumped in the shower curled my hair and then walked over to my beauty room here on the entrance you see some PR boxes I got to go through and then here's my desk with all the products I'm gonna be using in today's video well not everything but options in case I want to use something or the other and now I am just setting up how I'm gonna be filming today when I I film on reels I film with these two lights a ring light and then the makeup light so I set up right there before I get started I always have something to eat I'm just eating this really delicious salad it's my phone on this cool tripod and that is it and here is the finished look of my makeup as you guys saw at the beginning of the video but you can kind of see it now it is super orangey and bronzy and this is gonna go really good with all the outfits that we have planned out today I'm gonna walk you guys now to my bedroom because I have my wonderful assistant Mealy helping me right now say hello to Mealy she is helping me steam the clothes which by the way guys this is the best steamer on earth from Amazon I went to a shoot one time and a stylist was using this and I was obsessed with it because it steamed everything nicely but also the amount of water this can hold is crazy so when I shoot content day it's important for me to have everything planned out so that we're not running around like crazy and confused I try every outfit on before for, I make sure I like it and I pair it with what it needs to go so for example this outfit right here is paired with this top and then this purse and then with this outfit here I know that I'm gonna be putting the green shoes with it you know what I mean and then we have the second outfit which is the zebra top the cute little green bag and it's actually gonna be going with these green pants and then this white shirt so we're gonna kind of be recycling this shirt to be reused for something else we have this casual top that it's like a crop button up without the buttons but it has these little strings to tie around the waist and repairing them with my favorite H&M jeans that I'm loving at the moment and then we have this outfit which we're actually shooting this outside in the backyard because it's a bikini and this cute cover-up we have all that planned out and then we have all the shoes planned out we're taking today so my jewelry bag is something I always bring and I switch in between whatever I feel like I need to add or what I need to change and then this bag right here is the must we have all the hair products in here so I have my unplugged tool that I'll show you guys in just a bit I have brushes I have a couple hair sprays texture sprays and hair ties in case I want to switch up my hair from down to a pony I have a body oil because we are gonna be showing a little shoulder in some of the looks and, sh and legs so we do need the body oil and then I have the new Desi sunglasses that are honestly amazing we got all the right ones to go with all the outfits so I'm really excited I feel like we have everything planned out so what really helps me is planning everything out the night before like laying it out put it on the rack have everything so that when the next day comes and let's say you're about to leave you're like oh wait I forgot this I forgot that's easier for you to remember to grab things versus doing it all at once and feeling rushed and overwhelmed we're gonna go ahead and get the car loaded actually we're gonna load the bags so 
so this is look number uno. I am a fan of cover up, so I love the way it looks, and I have like an idea of what I want to do with it. Since it is like a pool shot, we're gonna be outside in the pool, not in the pool, but like in the backyard. I thought we have to wear glasses, and these are fun. So look number uno. Here we go. One beauty look down, one outfit look down, three to go. So we just arrived to our first location. <laughs> we are just in a parking garage. I love shooting in parking structures because you just get bomb lighting and then a really good view in the background. Should do a quick hair change as well. What I'm gonna do, because I still have these nice curls, we are just going to take this back into like a pony and then just twist up like that. And I have a large clip. I think that looks good. Is it your Doña? No. Should I make it more chloe? I like it. Yeah, me too. <laughs> what I even ask you guys? Now I'm gonna undress. Work with it. We're not gonna go ahead and change the hair. So I'm gonna go ahead and take my hair down and show you guys how it looks right now because it is nice and curly. I'm gonna go ahead and brush my hair out and get it prepared for this quick straightening that we're gonna be doing on it. The curls are still vibing and thriving. And honestly, they worked so good for the looks earlier, but we're now gonna move into a straight hair look. So as I mentioned earlier, we're gonna be using a JHG's newest unplug tool. It comes in this cute little pouch. And look how tiny it is. Well, it's actually not that tiny if you really look at it, but it is like slim and compact. So it's just something that you can pack easy, like in any bag or in a luggage. Plates here are 75% the size of the original one, meaning it's almost like you have a full size dialer with you. So this tool is something that you can use to give you one full hairstyle or for touching up. So for example, let's say earlier I was gonna stick with like the curls, but I was gonna switch like partings and whatnot. I would use this to touch up the partings or the ends. Or let's say like we go, I don't know, pick a spot. Disneyland. Disneyland, and he takes me on the water ride on the first ride as always so this is like the perfect tool to take because you can actually touch up and you're good to go so it's a cool touch-up tool cool to refresh when you're on the go in this case on a day where I want to do a completely different look I'm gonna touch up my entire hair this heats up in less than a minute and it's gonna beep once it's ready and it also comes with a USB-C charger meaning you could charge it in the car you could charge it in your laptop and it also comes with the outlet as well that you could charge like overnight so I'm gonna take in my bang area first I'm gonna take now a little bit bigger sections and go over just a couple times. You know the JHG stylers are more than just for one style. You can do so many things with it. So the hairstyles are endless. Like how many times have you guys gone somewhere? For example, you get off of a flight and then you have to go somewhere right after. When have you ever been like, dang, I wish I had a flat iron with me right now, like a cordless one, a portable one. That is why they made this because they knew we have been dreaming of a tool like this and I do just want to quickly mention that this is more of a touch-up tool so if you guys are at home getting ready I recommend just using like your regular flat iron if you're near an outlet use your tool that will go near the outlet but if you're on the go take this one with you we are done check that out less than 15 minutes to do this entire look and you know what I usually like my hair like bone 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 straight but it kind of left a soft curl because of the curls I had and I don't mind it I actually think it looks really cute um, when you guys are done though I recommend putting it away in your little pouch this is a heat resistant bag so you can put it back in there so that it doesn't burn you and it doesn't burn anything and then just a reminder that this tool is available now I have a link down for it below in the description box it also comes in white and black so pick your color now I'm gonna go ahead and grab this pomade stick from R Co. It's called Dark. And I'm going to run this right at the top where I know I have flyaways. And this just makes it nice and sleek. I'm gonna spray a little bit of my Moroccan oil hairspray. This is in the stronghold. Okay, moving on now to look number three. Gumpy has nothing on these pants. Do you know about Gumpy? Come on. Mealy doesn't know about Gumpy. Who knows about Gumpy down below? Okay, golfer.
right there, my friends, is a victory photo of being excited <laughs> that I finished all those photos. We did have one more outfit in mind, but I think we're gonna save that for another day because it's late. There's no more sun. It is seven o'clock. It's actually dinner time, and we're about to go actually eat some ramen right now. But when I get home, I'm going to import all the footage, go over all the photos, and select everything, and go from there. So let's um, let's go back to my house. Good morning. Just kidding. It's actually nighttime, but it is the next day because yesterday after we were done filming We wouldn't have had ramen and you already know that put me in a food coma. I did not wake up from that I was so stuffed and just feeling so good about how productive we were yesterday and how much work we got done I got back home. We did unload the car We got everything down and then I imported all the footage from this camera the iPhone and then the big camera all into my computer I started kind of importing things to where they got to go and started editing the video finish it off and we are here right now So um, what you guys are watching I'm in the middle of editing this But anyways the reason I'm mentioning this is because as I was editing I remember that I told you guys I was gonna talk to you more about my content planner and let me tell you if you guys don't have a planner. I do not know how you plan your life I am somebody who needs a physical planner I don't know if that's just the Virgo in me because you know you guys are my Virgo and I know I can do this all on my phone on my computer and on other devices But I like doing it the old-school way. I like having a physical planner I like being able to see my month, but uh, this is my planner from Target It is a brand new one all my planners start and end in July So in this case, it's starting in July. I was a little late to it So I'm gonna show you guys kind of how this works and how I fill it out. I did already fill up the month of August so I'm just gonna open up to a fresh month let's go to October because October is one of my favorite months so we're gonna go ahead and flip to like I said October so when I fill this out I use it for pretty much everything this is the main page that I review every single day I usually fill this out a few days before the start of the month and I write out all the ideas I have for videos for YouTube for photos I write out all of my sponsorships as well if there's any upcoming ones let's say on the 8th of October I have a video due for let's say June HD. What I do is always film a few days in advance so that I have enough time to film, enough time to edit, review it, and then turn it in. And then that gives enough time between the brand and myself to review change anything if we need to and so on so i always have the upload day but then i have like deadlines for myself this usually gets pretty pretty packed with a lot of things um work-wise personal meetings projects videos when i'm uploading when i'm not right here i have this note and to do but i use this more for things that aren't 100 percent let's say i have an upcoming meeting but it's not 100 percent confirmed i'll put it there before putting it on the date last thing i want to do is write out that i have a meeting and it was never confirmed and then i wasn't able to get the Things done this day so I always write out like potential things going on and so on over here but what's also really helpful when you flip the page so when you flip the page this side over here really allows you to get everything done if you like to work by the hour if there's top three things to do your for sure to-do list it even says tonight, it gives you a little gratitude section and then additional notes you need to add. The back pages are always so helpful when you just need to add additional things in there. And then over here, it also reminds you to do things that are fun, which I think is great. So go to dinner, go to the beach, go to the park, whatever it is. And then what is so cool too about this is that it gives you a page for each and every day. So it helps you really, really stay on top of it. Overall, the main calendar page is what I really fill out. Um, and then from there, when I'm completed with stuff, I do highlight things out. That way I don't get too confused. That's pretty much it. But yeah, this is so helpful. It's something I can't live without. And it really, really keeps me on track. Let me know if you guys use a planner, if you guys do everything by phone. Um, and let me know if you guys fill it out the same way as well. I'm so interested to see what you guys do. Um, but it's really easy. Get on the planner game. You will love it. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's day in a life video i hope this was fun to watch this something a little different and hope you guys just overall enjoyed it again thank you to jc for working with me in today's video and with that being said guys i will see you in the next one bye